Emergency providers frequently utilize tissue adhesives like cyanoacrylate glues for wound closure, especially in pediatric patients where sutures can be challenging. However, these compounds can inadvertently end up in unintended areas if the patient moves unexpectedly during the application process. The term cyanoacrylate adhesive tarsorophy refers to inadvertent gluing of the eyelids by cyanoacrylate. It's important to act quickly but remain calm. Eye irrigation along with manual removal of adhesive debris can help lessen the degree of chemically induced tarsorophy. Petroleum-based products like Vaseline or antibiotic ointment such as chloramphenicol ointment can be rubbed at the eyelashes and eyelid margins to help facilitate eyelid separation. If the lid still will not open, do not force it. Instead, continue massaging more petrolatum into the lid margins and arrange for an urgent ophthalmology evaluation. Forcing open an adhered lid risks iatrogenic injury to the delicate ocular structures. For patients with minimal eyelid fusion, conservative management is preferred as the cyanoacrylate adhesive will peel off within a week. Conservative management is often avoided in children because unilateral vision obstruction for up to a week may lead to amblyopia, lazy eye. Therefore, eyelash trimming can be performed. This procedure is generally poorly tolerated by children and may require sedation. While vision-threatening complications like corneal abrasions are rare with prompt treatment, close outpatient ophthalmology follow-up is prudent to monitor for any sequelae. Thank you for watching. Please subscribe to our channel by clicking the subscription button. If you have any questions, feel free to leave a comment below in the comments section.